Dr. Rudy, Mark, we're talking about astaxanthin. Can you talk about when we should maybe supplement? When we're younger, teens, 20s, is it more important to have it later in life, or do we want to start early so we don't get to the point where we need it? Yeah, that's a, that's a real good question. And uh, I believe that uh, astaxanthin, lutein, and zeaxanthin supplementation should start taking place uh, at a young age. Uh, we all know that uh, we have friends that have eye problems mm -hmm. uh, due to the fact that they were exposed to going to the beach when they were in college and that sort of thing. So at the latest, I would say college age, you should be, you know, high school and college age, you should be taking uh, astaxanthin. Also, if you're an athlete, antioxidants really help with fatigue, you know, uh, bounce back and that sort of thing, and it's not just acid and other antioxidants, including vitamin C, which is water-soluble. Uh, but uh, one of the uh, first uses of acid was in cross-country skiing in Norway, mm -hmm. and there were a lot of testimonials, the Norwegian ski team was using that as a endurance and bounce-back thing. Mm -hmm. In fact, there's a patent in Norway about using acid exactly for that. So I would say if you're an athlete, if you, if you know, tennis player, uh, I'm a bicyclist, I do a lot of bicycling, uh, it's really helped with my endurance and bounce back after, after exercise.